Hey, this is your favorite tech with another tutorial. Be sure to check us out on our website or text us if you need tech support. In this video, I'm going to show you how to resolve the black screen of death or infinite loading or booting or infinite loop. It's a common issue where it's stuck in a loop. So I'm going to show you how to diagnose this issue. We need to get to our troubleshooting menu. Power off your device three times in a row with a hard power reset and that will eventually get you to your blue screen automatic system repair. So just turn off the power with the button three times in a row and it will take you to the automatic reboot. So when you get to that screen, you're going to click advanced options, hit troubleshoot, select advanced option, select command prompt and we're going to enter in some information. When you get into command prompt, it should be system 32. Type in the letter C to, and a colon, then hit enter. Type DIR and hit enter, the Stanford directory. You should see program laws, program files, user windows. That means you're under the correct directory. So make sure that that drive is based around what your actual main drive is. So my computer is C drive. If yours is D, then you would type in D. Type CD slash forward slash windows forward slash system32 forward slash config backslash or forward slash as you see on the screen basically hit enter type in md backup if you have a duplicate file or a previous backup if you've done something like this add a one to it so you could technically use the word md or whatever you want to name it but md backup then type type in copy star dot another star another space back up and hit enter on your keyboard type cd space reg back then hit enter on your keyboard type dir again all lowercase hit enter on your keyboard again if it has all zeros on your entries it will not work for you so you would need to go back to system restore so it shouldn't say zeros on most people who have regular computers it should really long streams of numbers you really should be seeing right here i'm using a virtual machine that's why mine say zero so if you see all zeros just go back and do it through system restore so if you do have numbers it should be several million place values and then from there you're going to go ahead and type in copy space star dot star another space two dots back to back and then hit enter it's going to ask you do you want to overwrite you're going to type the letter a and then hit enter and at this point go ahead and type exit before you hit enter like i said before most people should not have zeros right there where my mouse is. if you do have all zeros this method won't work for you have exit typed in go ahead and hit enter and it's going to take you back to the blue screen. S select continue. That's pretty much it. I hope it solves your problem. Hey, if you found this video valuable, go ahead and return the favor by liking and subscribing to this channel. If you subscribe, type the phrase I subscribed in the comment section below. Keep in mind when you subscribe, it motivates us to continue to make these free videos. Lastly, if you enjoy learning about technology, entrepreneurship, or making money online, go ahead and check out my other videos on my other channel. Thanks for your support.